Who do we have here that has birthdays today? This month. This month. Mike. Mike. Alexi. Anybody else? Dan was supposed to be here, but he didn't make it there. I'm using a microphone. Do I need it? <laughs> Okay, so we got Mike and Alexi's birthday for this month, so let's sing happy birthday. Right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Mike and Alexi. Happy birthday to you. We got a uh, Valentine's and birthday cake up here, so everybody can have a piece of cake. Chad has some announcements to make because we got a lot of things coming up. I do. Yeah, we certainly do. Well, thank you all. You're welcome. For those of you who don't know, uh, last month towards the tail end we had our steering committee meeting, and I don't have my notes in front of me, and I'm not Sarah Palin. So. Oh, sorry. I'm in your Republican here. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to be playing this a little bit by ear today. So uh, we'll get to the raffle in just a minute. I just want to make some announcements first. Uh, we have a big agenda coming up this spring. We're going to be at Folsom Street East, if anyone's noticed this glamorous shirt that I wore to church today. <laughs> so we will have a booth at Folsom Street East. We've got the application over here. We're going to fill it all out and get that check sent in. We are going to be here. That means we need We're volunteers. We're going to be at the Gay Lesbian Expo at the Javits Center. We're going to be in the Brooklyn Pride March, we're going to be in the Queens Pride March, and we're going to be in the uh, Manhattan Pride March. And we're also, thank you Joe, we're also going to be doing security at the uh, Night of a Thousand Gowns with the Imperial Court of New York. <laughs> of course, this is a lot of stuff for Carl and I to do, so... And the bake sale. Oh, and the, we've got a multi-bear club bake sale coming up at the center, uh, which we are co-hosts of. So we're going to need your help, guys, because we're just two people. And Joe, he's very unreliable, you know, we just don't let him know that. So, we really need you to stay on top of things with the Facebook and the Yahoo group, I saw that. And make sure that you come and participate, especially with the Game Lesbian Expo, because it's a two-day affair, and we need people to man that booth all the time, work the crowd. Carlin and I are working on stuff for that right now, as far as a giveaway and a raffle and everything else like that. Plus, we need to make a big splash when we're in the parades. Marching with just three people and a banner isn't cool. We need to have a, a group like this. This would be awesome, really. So, anyways, keep your eyes on the Facebook uh, group. Keep your eyes on the Yahoo group. We'll let everybody know what's coming up and when it's happening. And uh, we hope to see you all there. What did I forget? Well, the Night of a Thousand Gowns is coming up in March. Yeah. That's, yeah. that's our next thing. Yeah. Night of a Thousand Gowns is next in March. What is the date on the 29th? 27. 27. No, guess yeah, the expo is the week before. So the expo is coming up. We have free passes for the people that are going to be helping us with the passing out material at the booth. So everybody that's volunteering both days, you get uh, free passes to get in. Um, on the website, for people that are, uh, uh, you know, if you're not participating, you get a $5 discount. We've got coupons for that also. So if you're not helping pass out material, but you want to go to the expo, there's a $5 discount coupon. Uh, you can also send the link to that or send it to your friends. Anybody can print it out and use it. It's not any, there's no restrictions on it at all. Plus we have um, uh, printouts of it here available today that you can take with you. That's no big deal. It's a big deal because you're That's why. So, um... We have two full days, one from 11 to 6, or 7, 11 to 7 on Saturday, and noon to 6 on Sunday to pass out Bear Den material. We also have uh, free condoms that we've gotten from the New York City condom program. Uh, condoms and uh, lube, we've got 3,000, so we can pass out uh, those, and we have them available for our, for our own use as well. <laughs> We're going to do some outreach uh, to promote Bear Den by putting together packets with Bear Den information in it, uh, together with a couple of, excuse me, a couple of 
uh, packs of lube, a couple of condoms, uh, safe sex information with Bear Den stamped on it. And then we can pass those out at uh, bars and promote Bear Den at the same time and by going around to bars. Okay. And um, it's done in other cities. It's very effective. Are you going to have teams for both days, like certain shifts, more than one shift? People can put it together teams or, or, you know, say we're going to the bars, you know, let's do this. And for the expo, I'm sorry, the expo. Oh, for the expo. And you have, like, two different two yeah. I'll put together a, a poll or a, you know sign up sheet and you can sign up for Saturday or Sunday whichever you want but um, we, we've got all the passes we need uh, and we'll have a booth all to ourselves to do that with anything else yeah it's kind of like taking a sip from a fire hydrant isn't it it's all going to be online so just pay attention please we're going to need about eight or ten people, or as many as we can, to do the security for the Night of a Thousand Gowns. For those of you who aren't familiar with Night of a Thousand Gowns, Joe can explain more about what it is and how it works and what it is. Okay. Night of a Thousand Gowns 